Okay, Miguel Rodriguez, uh, nice to have you here on the show. Hi, hey. how you, doing, <laughs> you always do good here at Delta Downs. You had an interesting horse the other night, uh, Mardi Gras Paint, who won the million last year. Yes. Tell us about that and, and how he matured last year, what it was like to win that million dollar race. Uh, it was awesome, you know. It was good to, uh, it's always good to win that uh, kind of race. And on him, uh, I think he just was a late bloomer, you know, he's just gonna mature late. We run him at first in uh, uh, Mardi Gras trials, he ran second, and then we give him an out here. He don't do too good, and then one in uh, New Orleans. And he just, when he get, we get to Evangeline, he just start getting better and better and better. And, and he got confidence when he win a maiden race, mm -hmm. and then come back and win the trials, and then ended up with a million. He just matured at the right time. Yes, huh? yes. He just picked up at the, the right time, you know. How, how confident were you going into the million? I mean, did you feel like you had the horse to beat, or were you really? No, I got, uh, actually, I got two horses in that race. Uh, it was a special political with the fastest time, and then uh, Mardi Gras Pain. Uh, I was kind of, I know both of them were, were, were good horses, you know, but it was just, which one, it was it was gonna come back better you on know? that day on that day right. yeah and the other one uh, make a little mistake at the gates and that cost him you know to run yeah. fit yeah but uh, both horses had a good potential that time you know now Mardi Gras Payne had taken off then he ran here the other night he drew the inside post mm -hmm. were you concerned about that because he looked very game all the way to the wire he fought them all off yes I mean he's a he get away good out of the gates you know that that's helped him a lot you know mm -hmm. you know everything is starting you get away good out of the gates you got pretty good, yeah, yeah you got a pretty good chance uh, to get better you know i was my concern was the uh, first time against older horses right you know? that was my big concern but uh, he handled it pretty good and and, and it doesn't it doesn't seem that he bother anything else yeah. like that now now he beat older horses the other night here at delta but now he's going to go on a three-year-old trials the delta downs derby trials in july how you feel about that uh i'm i feel pretty confident you know but there's a lot of good three-year-olds that they a lot of people just waiting for that race you know like that one that runs second and uh and some other horses but he's ready he's going to be ready he definitely need needed this out and we give him this out and he, he get more I, I think uh, without race he gonna get more confident more confident and everything and he's gonna be ready that's great well you have a superstar three-year-old but you also got a very nice older horse that the other night ran huge light him up with charm at 550 yards tell me how impressed you were with that effort mm, uh, he's a good horse you know we won the uh, New Orleans championship 440 championship with him and he got some trouble at the gates when I was uh, he used to run with a rig, you know, and we just, when he ran at New Orleans, you cannot wear, you cannot put a rig because the gates are different. So he ran good there, and then I run him a couple of times in uh, Shreveport, he ran third and fourth, but it was through 350, 330 and 350. So he don't, I think he, he like going further, you know, than that, and, and, uh, and he got away good last night, and when he, he got away like that, no, no, I knew that nobody can catch him. Nobody, you're pretty distance. confident yeah. once he uh -huh. got the yes. lead, huh? Uh -huh. Okay, now he's gonna go. Where's his next target? Hey, the classic here in uh, Delta, and uh, we're just gonna give him a little break before that race, and I think that's that's gonna be it for him uh, during this meet. Louisiana Classic race. on closing night, August 22nd, yes. right? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. So look forward to him and Mardi Gras paint in those trials. In those trials, you got quite a career going on here, Miguel. Keep it up, man. Yeah, thank you, sir. All right, thanks. Thank you.